Welcome to Eyes Gold, the first ever AI solution in the world that replicates the precise human jewelry retouching. And today I want to demonstrate to you how Eyes Gold can help you reduce the speed of your retouching by nearly 100%. And I'm not joking. In some cases, it will be 100%, meaning that you will upload the photo, wait for a couple of seconds, download it, and all you'll have to do is to do only the color grading and that's it and the photo will be ready to be delivered but today's example it's not that perfect and there will be some work left to do but i want to show you how you can save i believe 90 percent of the time on these kind of photos with always gold so let's take a look at the picture and see so here is the ring let's look at the details of the ring first of all look at the right side we get all like so many blemishes here, the dust. The surface of the ring is actually really sleek and glossy, but look how rough it looks like in the photo itself. Diamonds are not in focus. I believe the focus is somewhere here and this part is closer to the camera. So this one, I believe this one of the main diamonds is out of focus. So we need to refine this part. And look, the same kind of blemishes all around the ring. We got the logo here. And look, we have rough parts of the ring here. And yeah, I believe on that side as well. A lot of rough parts. I don't know if this, uh, if this is a reflection of something or maybe something else. I don't know, but it doesn't look nice. So we'll have to remove this. Just think about the time that you'd have spent on retouching this photo without always gold and let's imagine that you've just you've done nothing to the photo obviously you can prepare the photo and fix these parts white parts first before you upload it to our service and maybe that part if you want to remove this kind of shadows but i'm showing you the raw file so you could see the exact results that you're going to be getting from our platform. So let's pretend that we just grabbed the photo and uploaded to ois.gold website, waited for 30 seconds approximately, and downloaded this PSD file. And what we got, we got two layers, this one and that one, V1 and V2. And let's look at the gems first. And let's turn on the first layer, which works the best for the gems. You can obviously play with settings. Um, so this is just for the demonstrational purposes only. And look at the diamond. Look at the top diamond. You can like you barely could even see the circumference, the edge of the diamond, because it's not that round. But now, look at this. Look at this we got the reflection saved here as you can see on the right all the details are saved and the diamond looks pixel perfect and look all the outlines all the shape all the structure is preserved look at this only only the blemishes have been removed but nobody's gonna be zooming in to that extent so the that's going to be, I believe, the maximum zoom even like this on the website. And look how gorgeous the ring already looks. Look, before, after, before, and after. And look, pay attention to the diamonds in this section in the middle of the ring. Before, well, I mean, that's after, and that was before. Now, after. And that's it, we're done with the diamonds. That's it. It's just like, clicked on one layer and you got the diamonds so the next thing is the gold itself and the surface so we are turning on the second layer which is for the sleek and smooth look of like glossy look for the surfaces and let's look at that dusty nasty part of the ring so what we have, we have a strong shadow here. We got some artifacts, we get some rough, whatever texture shadow here. And we have like barely visible 
uh, border between the original ring and the attachment. We got these, whatever, whatever is this, it doesn't look nice, all this dust and trash. And what do we have on the left side? We got some strange shadow that should be refined and just a rough, rough surface. That's it. So now let's zoom in. And a twinkling of an eye, what are you, what are you getting? Boom, look at this, before, after, before, after, before, after, before, after. Isn't it amazing? Just think about it, how much time you would have saved with OS.gold. It's just incredible. There is nothing left to do to this part of the ring. Just look at it, how bad it looked like. It needed some time, it, indeed, it needed some time. Now it doesn't need even a second of your time. It's done, perfectly done. So, and you can see that even the border got preserved. Look at this, before and after, all these artifacts are gone, done, done done ain't it amazing it, it's freaking incredible and let's look let's look at the left side of the ring so that was before we got some artifacts here here the shadows like this corner and look we have what we have here the shadow has become smoother nicer more beautiful and look at the ring itself Wait, but before we can really enjoy the whole ring, we need to do one thing. We need to make diamonds. We need to make the diamonds look nice. That means I'm gonna use the eraser and I'm gonna erase the top layer. We can turn out the first one and the bottom one. Oh, I need to make it strong. Yeah, so I'm removing diamonds, not really, I don't really care about the, the metal. If I remove gold a little bit, it doesn't really, it's not gonna make a difference. Because both, both of the settings, they do retouch gold, unless you cut the diamonds separately and processed them the way you wanted it but it's done for the higher grade uh, retouching but for the general good quality retouching you don't need to do this kind of work with OIS, OIS gold. so I'm almost done with the diamonds and as you can see I'm not really paying attention like I'm not that precise at all. Just like saving, like even leaving some details, like remains of the diamonds from the second layer. Because you don't care, because both of the layers, they deliver really good results in the details. Now look at this. So let's group these layers. And that was before. And in a three minute time, you got this. Bro, it's just, it's just incredible. Imagine there would be no glare here, so you would see the whole metal and this glare would, did not exist. You are done. Okay, you can remove the letters, obviously, but you could do it before. So you can do kind of roughly remove the letters. Maybe in one of the videos in the future, I'll show you how it's done. So we'll do the photo before, and then I will run it through always gold algorithm, and we'll see how your rough edits are smoothened and perfected. And have a minute only. So that was before, 
the diamonds out of focus, the focus was here, some like not that clear contrast between the diamonds and the gold and gold this part. So now look at this. And it looks just amazing. This is before and after. It looks like pure real gold. Nice. Perfect. So what's left to do? The ring is not done yet. If you need to remove the letters, you can remove them. Uh, we got this part which uh, remove the letters. So what you can do, let's merge these layers. Okay, let's just merge them just for the speed of the video. And now we can remove the letters if you want to preserve them. So if you want to preserve them, what you do is you just carefully, or maybe not that carefully, move your eraser around. And that's it. Ha! We've just preserved the letters, the original ones. Amazing. But if you didn't want the original ones, for example, you could have only removed the top layer. So look. And we get slightly refined layer uh, letters that just look sharper. Look. That was the original photo. You see they're like too blurred. And boom, and they get that, not that attractive, dark uh, color. And now, look, amazing. And what we do here is we should remove both of the layers, this one and that one, to preserve the original logo. That's it. You can also remove this shadow, maybe work with that part. I don't like that kind of gradient here. It's kind of a border or a line. Let's see if I can do it real quick. Maybe I can. Let's make it small, smaller. Yeah, I believe I can do it. Ah, the wrong layer. Okay, that's done. Nicely done. Perfect. Kind of. Yeah. Okay, we remove the glare. We can remove this part. We also have to reconstruct that part. Yeah, but it's not going to take that much time of yours, especially if you'd have, you'd have done that before uploading to OS.gold service. Trust me, these parts would have been looking amazing. So, with that said, you, you've seen with your own eyes how drastically you can improve the speed with OS Gold service if you have these kind of photos. In the next videos, I'll show you higher resolution, like really big scale photos, like five by 7,000 pixels and how the service deals with these photos, preserving all the minor details, all these like transitions, the shadows, dust, how it removes imperfections, how it leaves the important um, metal shapes and texture and we always gold are daring you we dare you to challenge us and send us the worst ever photo that you have right now and just give it to us give us the raw file and see how we retouch it and how much time we save you with the results that come out from the service. So let's see. Just send us your worst photo. We will choose the worst one out, out of the worst. And I'll create a video with these photos that we will choose. And if you're a company like a jewelry manufacturer or a jewelry brand or you a photography studio that has humongous amount of photos, like a flow of jewelry photos every day, every week, thousands or hundreds of them, feel free to reach out to us. We'll offer you something that nobody will be able to beat. It will not have any competition at all in the world because the results that you'll be getting with our service will be in despicably incredible despicable incredible. So enjoy your day and see you in the next videos.